10 simple rules to be great in hockey. The third simple rule to being great in hockey is to do goal setting. Whether it's for your season, for a game, for a practice, or for a tryout, do goal setting. You need to set goals. There was a study done in Yale University in the, uh, in the 1950s, and basically with that study, uh, they interviewed the graduating class, and what they did with the graduating class was they surveyed them, and they said, do you have clear, specific goals with a plan for their achievement? And only 3% of the graduating class had clear, specific goals with a plan for, for achieving those goals. They went back 10 years later and they surveyed the same people. What they found out with those 3% were more successful than the other 97% combined. And one of the main reasons was goal setting. Another way to look at goal setting is pitcher plane taken off from Vancouver to Montreal. Well, it knows where it's going, it knows its goals. So let's say it puts it in autopilot. Well, what happens as soon as that plane takes off? Winds come up, a bird may hit it, it may go through clouds, it could get struck by lightning, all that stuff happens. And so it gets knocked off course the whole time the plane is off course, except it knows where its goal is. So what it does is it, it corrects itself and goes back on course. That is the power of setting goals. Okay, so we want to set goals. I remember a 14-year-old hockey player who was going to try out for a BC hockey league team and uh, that's that's junior hockey junior a hockey and so 14 years old is pretty young to go and he was going to the main camp so he came in him and his father and we sat down and we did a clear goal setting session of at the end of camp if he could picture anything at all what does he want to see what does he want to hear what does he want to feel so he wrote those things down and then he focused on them well, instead of going to the tryout thinking, oh, I hope I don't get cut, or am I going to get cut, or what's going to happen when I get cut, he wrote down things like, you know, I want to feel totally confident. I want the scouts or the general managers of the team saying, hey, I want you on this team. Maybe not this year, maybe in future years, because he was only 14 years old. He said, I want them to say, you know what, we really, you can play. You're good enough to play on the team this year, except you're 14, so the, law, the, the rules won't allow you to. Anyway, so he wrote that stuff down, he focused on it, went into camp, and had a tremendous training camp. I remember his father calling me after and, just, and saying, you know, the big difference was the mental part. This player actually never played in the BC Hockey League. His name is David Morissette, and David got snapped up, moved on to play for the Seattle Thunderbirds of the Western Hockey League on a four-year uh, successful Western Hockey League career, got drafted in the second round by the St. Louis Blues, Played four years professional hockey, including time in the National Hockey League. The power of goal setting. So, set goals. Sam, we do have goal setting programs for you. Goal setting audio, uh, uh, audios, audio programs for you, which will help take you through that. It's very, very important. So, that is the third simple rule to be great in hockey. Make it a great day. Until next time, stay great.